out. Let's drill. Re-education camps, forced labor, police brutality, civil war. These are not good times, my Kirati brothers and sisters. But who's responsible for all this plight? Pagan men. But say it. Let's talk about the elephant in the room, Pagan Min. Yes, the man's name sounds like a Cantonese death metal band, Pagan Min. Yes, he looks like he stole someone's Joker Halloween costume, Pagan Min. Yes, he looks like he robbed a metrosexual pimp. Yes, he is the delusional psychopath maniac who killed the leader of the Golden Path and is now doing everything in his power to erase our proud heritage as true-blooded people of Kirat. But you know what? We are still here. We are still here, standing strong. The golden path is still here. I'm still here. Chotu's still here, until I fire him. But we are still here as a proud people. And we will not stop until Bagan and his governors are dead. That's right, all the governors. Every single one of them. Noor, Yuma, and Paul. Once that happens, I'm going to do a little jig on their grave. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna dance right on top of their grave. Chalo, nach kar le. Chalo, nach karo. Chalo, nach karo. Chodu, dance, man. Nach karo. Well, if Sabal doesn't want us to have drugs, he's got to replace the drugs with something, okay? I mean, have you been to a party and, and people say it's no alcohol, no drugs, no music? And you're like, why the fuck did I come to this party? But then again, I've been around really, really religious people and they're losing their minds and it looks like they're tripping balls. Maybe they're onto something. What if getting filled with the spirit is actually like shooting snap? <laughs> food for thought. You know, those religious types might be enjoying it. Why else would you abstain from everything fun in life, right? I mean, I met a dude that isn't into meat, music, money, or medicinal, and he's having the time of his life. Maybe I need to make God my dealer. something, okay? I mean, have you been to a party and, and people say it's no alcohol, no drugs, no music? And you're like, why the fuck did I come to this party? But then again, I've been around really, really religious people and they're losing their minds and it looks like they're tripping balls. Maybe they're onto something. What is getting filled with the spirit? It's actually like shooting snack. <laughs> That's a food for thought. Religious types might be enjoying it. Why are they all from the fun in life, right? I mean, I met a dude 